This is the Hiltec Wireless Paper version 1.1, an e-paper styled LoRa radio powered by the ESP32. And I'm making you guys this video to let you know that this is one of the LoRa radios to absolutely avoid. Due to quality control issues, it doesn't regulate power very well. And after only a week of use, this little guy absolutely crapped out on me. I'm definitely a fan of low power consumption e-paper displays. And I am a fan of different Helltech products. But if you're looking for a low power consumption LoRa radio, this one is not it. Now that doesn't mean that all Helltech products are bad. We will be going over different Helltech products in the future. So be sure to like and subscribe. But let this video serve as a warning that the Helltech wireless paper is not it. There are plenty of other, better, cheaper options. Also, mind you, I did disconnect the display, but that was only because I was try trying to do anything to try to get it to power on. After using my thermal cam at work, I was able to determine that there is this little guy right here is the problem, which are the components that regulate power. So that came to no surprise. But if you are determined to get an e-paper displayed LoRa radio and you're determined to buy one from Helltech, might I recommend their Vision Master. Now, this is the Vision Master 2.9. And we will be doing a full breakdown on this device very soon. But if you're looking for a Helltech e-paper display, go with this one. Do not go with the wireless paper. Plus, the Vision Master is just simply stunning. Now, I will be reaching out to Helltech for a replacement, but we'll see what they say. But until then, stay far, far away from this device and go with a better, more efficient LoRa radio. And in the coming weeks, we'll be going over a giant variety of LoRa radios.